don't recommend that in the slightest because it's often okay. discouraging. It's often discouraging. I mean, if you're going in without having the proper foundation, the results aren't going to be what you want. Okay. Now, that being said, if you want to take those results with a big grain of salt and say, hey, this is where I'm at right now and use it as a benchmark to measure your later progress, that's totally fine. But to me, a diagnostic is often, it's meant to help you figure out your weak areas and focus on them. But with the LSAT, typically everything's going to be a weak area at the beginning because it's so unlike what you've learned in school. Thanks for tuning into the show. Please subscribe if you haven't done so already to be notified of new episodes as I release them. And feel free to reach out if you need anything at all as you move forward with your prep. I'm happy to help however I can. In the meantime, I wish you all the best and take care.